like, I got this. Oh! What the heck? Babuha, it's a music reaction time. Oh, uh, yes. Today, we got a Marcelito treat. And he's doing a duet. He's not going to try to do it by himself. He's not going to get cocky like, no girl, I got this. He's doing it with Morissette. It's a real duet. This, this is a real duet. Because one thing that I always think about, and I'm always a little bit concerned with, because as Marcelito has really blown up across the internet. I mean, mm -hmm. right now, he is probably our number one reaction to date. On yes. His first performance, America's Got Talent Champions, has been mind-blowing. The whole world now know of his capability to see both guy and girl. But, mm, but, but, what's the but? The but is, I think a lot of people are concerned it might be a novelty act. That is cool and it's unusual, but is he really a good singer? We never actually heard him try to do it serious in a way. So this will be interesting ah, because he's okay. got to figure out how to sing well with Morissette, who we already know brings uh, her triple A right. game. Uh -huh. I mean, probably one of the best singers in the Philippines. So this would be interesting, you know? And, mm. <laughs> <laughs> After watching Marcelino on America's Got Talent Champion, we are craving for more, more, more. That's true. That's the other problem with someone who sings duets like this is that he doesn't exactly have a big range of songs he can jump onto mm -hmm. that allow that kind of breath, that capability to go back and forth. So this would be cool to be able to hear him just see what his regular voice is like. Unless right. he's literally also seeing the female part and more to decide to go, <laughs> I, I got the guy part this time. That would be a novelty act right there. <laughs> that would be a cuckoo Aww. rendition. All right, let's watch this. Secret love song. And away we go. For a new Wish 107.5. Then he even brand this. Wish, we know it's you. Oh, during concert. Professional, baby. Professional. Does she even need Marcelita? <laughs> She's like, I got this. Well, I guess he is trying to sing Guy Girl, but his guy voice is a lot higher. This might be his normal range here, I think. I feel I feel some like <laughs> pressure <laughs> for sure it's not we gotta love that it's oh my gosh what can you love me in the street what can I kiss you on the dance floor Her signature Oh, the whistle, baby. The whistle. Oh, That's what we love about Morissette. Now that's his voice. Yeah. This is interesting because I don't think I've ever heard him sing this way before. It's just that he has to find his niche to be able to be known, right? Because everybody can sing. And if you're a singer, yes, you can sing. It's the okay. competition. Let me see what you're saying. <laughs> if you're a singer, everyone can sing. <laughs> but, but, oh, uh, yeah. Okay, let okay. me just rephrase that. Can 
He's doing some yeah. very interesting intonations and inflections in his voice, huh? Is this a uh, English song or a Filipino song? Do you know? <laughs> I'm not so sure. The original song? Yeah. He's trying to stand up, said. Morissette, right, show him how it's done. Go up there. Go, go, go up there. <laughs> I mean, with Marcelito, we know just based off of the views, he's got a huge fan base. Mm -hmm. But we know that Morissette tends to be more of the recording artist type of person, bye, right? Bye. Like she's got the big concerts and whatnot. And I haven't seen Marcelito in concert yet, actually. He's done a couple of small venues I've seen him do. Like in Dubai, he's been performing. He's been traveling around. Mm -hmm. But big auditorium, stadium kind of stuff. It's like his own concert. Yeah. A lot yeah, is now. Yeah. Let us know. Yeah, Morse has a lot of her own songs, so I think that might be, you know, the difference. Oh my gosh, this is a crazy performance. I was shocked in the beginning, right? Yeah. Marcelito's voice was so good that if you're just not looking on that screen, you would think it was a female singer. Yeah, but here's the thing, right? His female, uh, I wouldn't say impersonations at this point because he can sing it in a very natural way, right? Mm -hmm. Like like you said, you didn't know better, you would think it's a female. But you have his voice and you compare it to Morissette's voice and they're almost in the same range right at the beginning. Her voice still sounds fuller mm -hmm. because the way he has to do it, I think, is constrict his voice, right. his vocal right. cords to get to that high note. Um, yeah. And so it tends to be a narrow range right. while her voice is very, very full up there. And she's able to like go all over the place with it. Because she's using her, her natural voice. Yeah, because that's her natural voice. voice. Yeah. Yes. Whereas you could tell when he sings in his lower register, his natural voice, he could do a lot more interesting things with his voice at that range, which apparently isn't very, very low, which he sometimes sings, you know, like in the prayer and with Andrea and Bocelli. <laughs> Bocelli. Let's just say that. Yeah. Uh, that's, you know, that song that he does. But nonetheless, really interesting collab. I love it. I wish they would do more. <laughs> this is actually a lot of fun. It's insane. I love it. Oh I didn't God. realize like Wishbus had started to do music awards. Yeah, that's crazy. It's not as big. It's not as small. Yet it's very not big. Did you see that auditorium? It's yeah. filled. Yeah, it's filled. It's, but it's, it's not... a huge auditorium. Really? It's basically a huge concert. Yeah. Nice. It's... I mean, they can for sure hold it because they're so known. They're known even in international. Wish Buzz is well, known. Well, I'm assuming that if it's a music awards, that there's a bunch of other performers in there as well. That's mm -hmm. that's the point. They bring out the best people. Right. You know what it kind of reminds me of, and I think Wish has this amazing opportunity maybe this is their business strategy but it reminds a little bit like iHeartRadio iHeartRadio does their own awards now has mm -hmm. their own radio station has their own concerts and it's become a go-to source for listening to a bunch of different artists put together in mm -hmm. that kind of yeah basically they're going beyond the typical model of being which is just a radio just a radio station right, right? Actually, one of my friends from uh, grad school was, I think, the general manager for iHeartRadio for a while. Anyways, oh. Marcelito. Well, I really actually want to just check out Marcelito, even though we haven't done a Morissette reaction in a while. Just because at this point, I wanted to give everyone, especially all of our new fans, an opportunity to see that Marcelito is not just... A doble cara... Novelty act. Novelty exactly. act. Exactly. That he is a straight-up, legit right. singer. Singer! Absolutely.